what got you first interested in Denny's character? Um, I read you had a little punk rock experience, a childhood, you loved the music. What, what got you into it? I, I, I grew up listening to punk rock music and um, and I grew up in a place, I mean, I grew up out, out in the sticks and mm -hmm. they, there were like five of us who liked punk rock oh, out no. there. Um, but it really made me feel, what I loved about that music was um, it felt very inclusive and it was simple enough that, that, that it didn't feel alienating mm -hmm. or too complicated. It really, you could feel, you know, you could feel the sweat and the humanity and, mm -hmm. and, and the rage. Yes. And I think especially as a teenager, we have so many feelings mm -hmm. and, it's, and it's great to have a place to, to channel those. Yeah. Um, and when I first read the script, I have never, just to clarify, um, you know, and to keep my ego in check, I have never said this about another part, but I read the script and I, I, I said, nobody, nobody can do this part better than I can. Mm -hmm. I, I know this guy through and through, and I don't even have any kids, yeah. but, but the way that he loves and where he comes from and, and where his priorities are in, mm -hmm. in, in life is very much the man that I've always aspired to be and done, yeah. done a lot of work to, to continue to move towards. Nice. And so, um, and, and that balance between, you know, ha having a youthful passion for music yeah. and life and also, you know, really starting to accept the responsibility of adulthood yeah, yeah. And, and, and the responsibilities that come along with, with being a parent, both for Kat and Danny. With the whole parenthood, um, some would say you and Kat are pretty unconventional when it comes to parenthood. Um, what would be Denny's fatherhood advice to someone else? I think Denny's main advice to somebody else would be um, just be cool, man. <laughs> Just be cool. Do yeah. what you say you're gonna do, and uh, and and sometimes you have to give things up for your kids, and that's okay. Mm -hmm. And what was one of your favorite scenes from the movie? There were so many scenes that I loved, but but I would say probably my favorite scene to shoot was the big barbecue scene where Everyone's where everybody gets yeah. around uh, gets around and has a big old jam session, mm -hmm. and it's kind of Mia's extended family. Yeah. And, we get to see uh, we get to see how much creativity and love she's surrounded by on a daily basis. Great. Now you don't get to say last words to Mia in the film. What would be your last words um, to her if you could? Hmm. That's a really sweet question. Um, just go be extraordinary, baby. Mm -hmm.